All right, I'm going to teach you how to properly store a hat. Now, by this, I mean in your house. So a lot of people, when I get hats from them, they say, oh, I put it in the dash of my vehicle and left it there. And then it looks like you overcook bacon in the microwave because that's exactly what you did. So I'm going to talk about kind of the two different ways to store a straw and then obviously a felt. So I like to keep old straws around for lots of reasons because I can't get rid of a hat apparently, but I use them to store my felts. One thing, one big mistake I see people make is, you know, what they're about to do is what I'm going to do is they stack multiple, multiple hats on top of each other. So they take this and they just keep going. Now, if you like this hat, never ever put anything on top of it. You will make crease lines. You'll make sweat lines. Some of that stuff you might not be able to get out. So think about that. But I take an old straw that I have and I go and find a cool, dark, closet. And the reason for that is I want the temperature and humidity in there, especially when I'm storing a felt, to just stay pretty constant. If I have this somewhere where it's going to see sun, half of this hat might turn a different color than the bottom half of the hat. Okay, so keep that in mind. But you're just going to set your old straw down and then just lightly put this one on there. Do not cram it down. You're going to actually reshape the inside or stretch things that you don't want to stretch. And that's how I leave it all winter long, just like that. Now I've seen people put, you know, there's like hat um, covers, like bags to kind of keep dust off of it. If you're in a place where it is dusty, sure, go ahead and do that. The thing I worry about that is, you know, that change in the shape of it, you know, holding in humidity when it doesn't need to. If you're really wor worried about that, take a tea towel, stick it on there, call it good, forget about it. Okay, now just your daily storage of either one of these. Now straws, Certainly, you know, don't store them down on the brim. We've showed, you know, pictures of us doing that. That's temporary. We don't actually do that. You need to store a hat on the crown. So for straws, if it's not your junk straw that you're using to store your felt, I set them in the closet anywhere out of the way, just like that. No science to it, but that's going to pull out and be the exact same um, as it was. So just remember, do not store them on their brim. If it's a hat you like, never stack it on the bottom. Keep an old hat around to store your felt for all winter long. That's going to come back looking nice when, uh, or not winter long, excuse me, summer long, uh, when you need it for a time like this uh, right here in the fall. So if you like this video and want to see more videos just like this, please like and subscribe to the Startup Cowboy channel.